Okay, in this video we're going to show you how to make this marvelous little table center. You will have so much fun with this. It is very easy and we're offering the pattern for $2 on our website. So go ahead and download it. I think you'll have fun. Xerox your pattern. Cut it out on the outside solid line. Then you're going to cut six and I do this in one cut. So I've got it folded, salvages together and then I'm going to fold it in thirds so that'll be six then I'm going to pin this right on that and it should just barely edge if fit edge to edge if this is 45 inch wide fabric and I'll do one cut then on my backing I just do a, a rectangle or a square that will fit that way you don't have to try to match the points or anything. You're going to sew it and then cut it out. So I then cut out my bonded fleece, which uh, is what they use to make purses. It gives this a really nice body. Then I'm going to cut out the fleece a quarter of an inch smaller so that all that bulk is not in the seam but it's going to be in the body and place it right sides together with my square backing and then sew it a quarter of an inch in leaving this part open for hey, turning. Well, I cut it out you can cut it smaller than the quarter of an inch especially on the tips just don't cut the seam you don't want to compromise that seam and then um, once it's cut, and I don't cut it here, I don't cut it here because that little extra can help turn it under. But what I do is go to the very tip with the inside, put my finger up, and then bring that tip out the opening. Turn it right side out. And then I want to be careful to press it and make sure the points of the ivy here on the outside are poked out. There's no background showing on this front and I want my point to be pointy. Yep. Now use our little leaf that we have in our pattern to place up on the edge and pencil in the marking of where you're going to sew. And these have to be kind of exact, otherwise your petals will be different sizes, even if it's just off a little bit. So lay that right up there, pencil it, and then put two together and sew it. And that's how you'll get these exact leaves going around. Here is our table center finished. Very easy to do and just so beautiful with our little Christmas candle in the middle and I hope you enjoyed this.